Hi guys, I'm Tiana and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you a sorority room tour. So basically, all of the sorority houses are basically the same on the inside. They're all the suite style rooms. So it's a room and then a bathroom and then another room. So I'm just going to be showing you guys what my room looks like. And yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. All right, so before you walk in, I just have this little bulletin board and my roommate and I both decorated it. That's a picture of us right there. Her name is Sarah. She's super nice. And then this is just the door. All right, so this is what it looks like when you first walk in. We just have like this little hallway thing with the sink and like, this is the bathroom. So it's suite style, so that means this is a room here and then the bathroom, and we share it with two other girls. And this is like the little door and like the closet. So this is my closet. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. So it's a little bit messy, but I kinda tried to clean it up for you guys. So honestly, for a dorm closet, this is kind of pretty standard. This is on the larger side, actually especially compared to where I lived last year, which was Rollins Hall. But I have this little shelf up here. I have just some shoes and like bags and random stuff. And then the clothes. And then in the sorority houses, you have to get a shoe rack because we have like the double doors. So it's not gonna work if you get an over the door one. And then I just keep my laundry in there. And then we have this bathroom mirror. And I'll show you the vanity. So we have the largest room in the house, I'm pretty sure. And it has the biggest vanity as well. We have like all the storage stuff under here. I just have like random skincare and makeup. And then I have like all my hair products and like other girly stuff. And then I'll show you like the makeup. So I got these from Marshalls. They're just a little clear acrylic ones and a little brush holder also from Marshalls. Jewelry organizer, just like hygiene type of stuff, my retainer. And then I ordered this little palette holder from Amazon. I think it was like six or seven dollars. And I really like it so I can just see like all my palettes standing up. And then just makeup wipes and like towels. I got my towels from Walmart. They're all this pattern. And our theme is kind of like gray and white. The lighting's a little bit weird. Let me see if I can fix that. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. But anyways, this is my side. And it just looks like that. The little overview. Then this is my roommate's side. We bought our comforters at Walmart, I think, online. We wanted to like match. Our theme is like gray with like accent colors. And then I'll just start with like this side of the room. So I have my decorations up. This is from Target. And then those little picture hangers are from, I think Michael's or Hobby Lobby, like some kind of craft store. I had these in my room freshman year, so I just reused them. And then I have a little lamp that clips on. It's super helpful to have it. I would recommend it if you have a roommate because at night when she's trying to go to sleep, I just turn on this light instead. I have my eye mask, all my pillows. This one's from Target. This one came with the bedspread from Walmart. And then I got a silk pillowcase or satin actually. It's a little wrinkled, but it's from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Um, it's really good for your hair, so I would definitely recommend this kind. And then this is from Walmart as well. I have my little bear that Kobe got me. And then this is from Marshall. No, it's actually from Target, and it has a little fuzzy thing on it. So that's basically like what the bed looks like. And then I got this tapestry from Walmart. I just got it because I wanted to like fill up this space. And then I got this bedside caddy from Amazon and it just has like a little scarf that sometimes I sleep with in my hair to make it not get frizzy. And then I have like my iPad for watching Netflix in bed. And then I think I just have like lotion, 
So that's all I have in there and also I would highly recommend getting a bedside caddy because it makes the room look less cluttered because you can just shove everything in there. And then usually I'll just hang my purse from this little post. Just keep it there. And then underneath the bed I have all of my storage. So this came with the room and I'll just show you like it's really big and it like fits all my clothes so in the top I just have like denim shorts and skirts and like some little crop tops and then I have like t-shirts and like workout clothes and then in this one I have like pajamas and like sleeping shirts and stuff like that so that's basically all I have in there I just have like more storage this was more for my room freshman year, but I just kind of kept it. Honestly, I don't really use anything in here, but I just like to know that I have it just in case. And then like underwear, and like these are my extra sheets, some loungewear for when it gets a little bit colder outside. And then I have this like mermaid blanket thing that my big got me, and it looks like a tail. It's super helpful for when I'm like studying at my desk because it gets kind of cold in here. And then I just have like bras in that one, socks, and then like one hat. And then I have my little um, drying rack. I have a notification. Okay, I fixed that. And then here's my desk. I just have this little chair that I got from Home Goods. And the sorority that I'm living in, they didn't provide a chair with like the desk. So that was honestly pretty weird. But, you know, I got this one, and it's pretty comfy. And on it, I just have my blanket because, again, it gets kind of cold. And then here's my desk. It came with the room. And then I just have my laptop. I have this little picture of my family. And then my jewelry. And then just, like, some perfumes. This is my mirror. I don't really use it that much because I get ready in front of the sink but I just like to have it just in case. And then a little desk lamp. Then I have like this extension cord. This one was from Bed Bath & Beyond. I think, yeah, it's really nice because it has like little USB ports. And then just my laptop charger. I have like my accounting textbook. I hate that class. And then just my planner and a bunch of notebooks. In college, most of your stuff is online so you don't really need textbooks, but I just like having that one so I can read it. And then just like random things like a camera and like headphones and gum. I kind of just put like random stuff that I don't want to clutter the room in there. And then this I just have like my camera and stuff like that. And then I have my backpack, the shoes I was wearing earlier. And then I have this rug. I used it last year as well. And then this is new, this little ottoman thing. I got it because my bed is kind of high up, so I like step on it to get into bed. That's the only reason I really bought it. And then my trash can. We got this little um, bedside table from Home Goods as well. But I really like how it looks with the gray theme. And then my fan is from target I would highly recommend bringing a fan because we can't control like the thermostat and then you also can't burn candles so we have these little um what are they called oh yeah they're like room sprays so vanilla bean pumpkin cupcake and then vanilla bean noel and then my roommate has one too it's the sugar warm vanilla sugar and then she brought this lamp we never turn it on, it's just kind of for decoration. And this is my alarm clock from Target. We don't use it as an alarm clock, we just use it for like the time. And then there are two drawers, but they're kind of more decorative. They don't really open that well. They're like really, I don't know, they're like annoying. They get stuck a lot. And then we just have like tissues, beads pill, and some light reading college guide magazine and we have the nicer version of the windows we have like the shutter ones because we're on the first floor so i like that a lot 
Oh, and here's all of like our food. So all of the rooms, like all of the rooms in the UNT sorority houses, they have like a little food storage thing. So we just have like these little baskets where we put food, that's Sarah's Cheez-Its. And then like containers. I have this Keurig that I haven't used yet because I don't know, I'm just kind of lazy. And then my vitamins, salt, pepper, sugar, peanut butter. Anyway, you can see you have eyes. And then here's just the little refrigerator with some magnets and I have a little command strip hook thing where I like hang my keys so I don't lose them. And oh yeah, so the last thing I'm gonna do is show like the little decorations I have. So I already showed you this and those, but I have these canvases that my big Sydney made. I really like them, they're super pretty. And I have this, I also had this in my room freshman year. I just have some, this is my mom, my best friend Tuesday from back home. That's Kobe, my boyfriend. There's us again, Chance the Rapper, ACL. This is my graduation pick. No, actually this was before graduation. I decorated my cap. That actually got, the picture got retweeted by the UNT president, so I was super proud. That's me and my dad, me and my grandma. And then that's one of the Migos. This picture I took a long time ago. And there is my bid day card. So yeah, that is basically all that I have. I'll just do like a little overview. Yeah, so that is basically the complete room. It's pretty small, but this is one of the bigger rooms in the house because it's downstairs. But I like it. I mean, I like living here. It's really fun. I love my roommate. And this is just our little hallway. So that's basically it. All right, so that is my completed sorority room tour. I really hope that you enjoyed. I really had a fun time filming this. And um, if you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. And yeah, I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.